Hey, what's up, BrewTubers? Hey, just for a good, I'm doing a brew day. Just thought I'd pop in and uh, do a quick uh, cam up for this, this homebrew I got from Mike J, uh, this Baltic Porter. I mean, when you get homebrews, uh, when you get one like a Baltic Porter, you know, or like some heavy Imperial Stout or, you know, double dry hopped IPA, I mean, it's, you really appreciate them because, I mean, these are, these beers are, you know, not your average run in the mill. I mean, it's, a lot goes into it, so. I don't get a whole lot of Baltic porters, so so I'm really excited about this one. Thank you, Mike. All right. I believe I have the right glassware for it. Uh, sure looks like a Baltic porter. It's got this little kind of tanny, tatty, or I don't know what you call it, the brown at the very edge of the glass not even ruby uh mm, smells delicious hey cheers man mm. this is a good football beer right here uh and i'm watching football right now while i'm while i'm brewing i'm doing a really slow sparge so oh this is good I need to make a Baltic Porter one of these days. Uh, SJ a while back sent me some yeast um, from Omega, I believe. And it was supposed to be good for a Baltic Porter, but I just never used it. It's probably still in the refrigerator. I don't even know if it's any good anymore, but um, it's just a style that I've never done. I've done porters, but I've never done a Baltic Porter. I think it's a lager yeast. Uh, I don't know. I'll have to read up on it, but mm. this is terrific, Mike. Thank you so much, man. <clears throat> if I work up enough nerve, I might split one of those uh, blithering idiots with my wife. With my wife tonight, she likes uh, barley wines too. Anyway, all right. Well, I, I just wanted to pop on, say hi, shout out to uh, to Mike J, dude. I hope the wedding went well. Um, maybe you're on your honeymoon right now. I don't know how long has it been. No, no, maybe you're back already. Anyway, a, uh, thanks again for the Baltic Porter. It's delish. Cheers.